tastes nasty with my... Oh, that tastes nasty after just brushing your teeth. Ugh, but I actually do kind of like it. I actually love that stuff. Alright, guys. So, I got a little ahead of myself. And I put in brand new... I put in white... I put in white, um... White license plate lights. Man, it's a little dark, isn't it? It's a little better. So, back to where I was. I put in white license plate lights in this. In this puppy right here. And, um... What do you call it? I mean, it doesn't really take much. All I have is a Phillips screwdriver. And then you just use a Phillips screwdriver. And I kind of, like, pulled it out with, like, my nail. And I worked. I, like, pushed on one side. Had the other side come out and pulled it out. Um... But yeah, that's, that's really all, all I've done. All I did, and I put in the new balls, and I'll show you what the new bulbs are. I got these from um, AutoZone, and they're uh, 194s. Let's see if I can zoom in on this right there. Yeah, they're 194s. The Sylvania. I don't know what the heck those are. As you can see, it's ripped, and I got the stock bulbs in there. That's what I do with all my, uh, um, my license plates, with all my parts. I'll take the stock ones off, put them in the packages, and put them away in a box under my bed. And uh, I'll do that just in case if, if I ever sell the car, I'll, I'll put them back on. Or like if I ever have problems with the new ones, I'll put the stock ones in because, you know, there's nothing worse than not having it. But yes, sir, so I'm just going to take these two light bulbs off. I believe this one's closest. I believe they're they're in, intertwined. I, I should, I could be able to say. They're intertwined, so there's like, there's a wire that this comes to that's inside the trunk. And um, or that goes through the trunk and like connects to the car, but then this one goes relays to this one, and that's how they are. So this one comes out, I think, less than this one does, or, the, or it's the other way around. I'll show you right now. All right, so I got my four screws right there inside the trunk, you know, just holding it there for me. And then here you go. So that one's pretty much popping out, and this one's you know, there it goes. So I'm moving, move the trunk a little bit. So this one. See, it barely comes out. It only comes out that much. Where this one comes out, look at that, it comes out a little bit more. And I believe the reason why is because this one actually relates to this guy. And it goes through down the trunk and it goes through this, this nice little piping that goes inside the trunk and plugs into the car. And that's where it gets its uh, electricity from. Um, but pretty much all you do with this, I could probably do it with one hand. Bah! Turn it, pop it off. This one, same thing. Um, I'm not gonna do it with this one because it actually, because it only comes out that much, it was really hard to uh, get in. But then uh, all you do is just push it, push it back in, screw it in, line it up. But right here, I mean, this is what you're gonna do with both of them, obviously. You're not just gonna have one white light or one blue light, depending on what you're doing. But you just pull really hard on this guy and you use your other hand to pull that back. And it's really in, it's really in or out, honestly, though. But, um, like, see how it's flat? Let's see if I can zoom in on that. See how it's flat? And then it actually, here, I'll pull it off for you. All right, so see how it's flat? And then it's like skinny and then flat. Well, all right, so you, this is gonna be, this is the only issue you're probably gonna run with this, is just put it in no matter how, whatever way you think it goes, just put it in. Um, Cause I put them both in. I was like, whatever, I'll just put them in, see if it works. And um, like, so I had them in this way, right? And I went to turn the car on to see how they looked and all that. They didn't work. I was like, what the heck? I got some bad bulbs. But actually, I've had this problem before in my other vehicles. All you do is take them out and you put them in the other way. Both, do it on both of them. Um, if they both don't turn on, if one turns on, just do it to the one that didn't turn on. Just pull it out, put it back in, and that's the problem. That's the problem, like, honestly, 80% of the time. I rarely get bad bulbs. Um... Not saying like autos aren't super reliable or anything like that, like they're never wrong, you know, but um, I, I've i never gotten bad balls. Every single time they, have, they haven't they have worked, I just turn them around and it works. Um, but that's about it. It's a pretty pretty simple process. Sorry this video is so long for, you know, license plate lights, but, you know, just making sure you guys, you guys are really knowledgeable on what you go into. Thank you for watching. This is the White Bunny and Michael. We'll see you guys next time.